They said it's called Santa Claus melon. You gonna try it? The yellow watermelon? Oh my goodness. This is the fun stuff. How cute are all of these little guys? The macaron selection is crazy. Hey babes, back at one of my frequent places, the car wash, getting ready to clean out some of this mess again. It's only been, what, two days, but it feels up fast when you're sharing a car with your husband and five kids and five dogs and nieces and nephews and everybody else. So we're at the car wash. <laughs> barbecue today so me and Tony are about to go to the West Side Market it's been a while since we've been over there we went and explored like this um, collectors like building it was just a bunch of collections of stuff that they were selling and they had a picture of the Guardian that sits on the bridge and that's what our baseball team the Cleveland Guardians is named after but we're actually about to go across that bridge um to get to the west side market so i wanted to show you guys what that guardian actually looks like they are actually on both sides of the bridge you can see them just up there i don't know if you can really see much of the detail but yep those are the guardian bridges all right we're here at the market we're about to go make it short and sweet because i think really um we're gonna keep it simple on the grill today i want to do maybe a steak or two some corn and if we see a good price on maybe like some chicken breast or something and then make like a real good what Caesar salad <sighs> something simple really just got a taste for that sweet corn and a good steak any type of open market they get aggressive so just FYI you said it's called Santa Claus melon you gonna try it give it a try It's a yellow one too though, right? So that means it's heavy, so we're gonna have to grab it. Canary yellow? Right. <laughs> and here you go. That's a different, that's a yellow one. Okay. It's canary. Yeah. They're almost about to make some little taste. This one more, it's softer. I kind of almost yeah. like the firmer one better, the green one. And the fresh cut fruit is two for six dollars. That's actually not bad. Is the yellow sweet? I told you guys, it's actually kind of mild today, but yeah, it gets aggressive in here. Yes. Look at this. Rosemary. Smell this together like this. On the steak. 
Just after you cook your steak, some butter, put these in it, a clove of garlic, just spread your steak in it like that. That's all. Make it fancy like the fancy. Yeah, we should get that. Can you give me a, a nice little bundle? You want to get some of the potatoes? The potatoes, the corn, and then onion. And a little onion. Just one. We will just that. Yep. And then um, some the mushrooms. Yep. And the corn. In the corn, yep. And then we'll be back right Take back. Okay, thank you. You better try every corn milk. You hear? Oh, sweet corn? Yeah. Yellow watermelon. Oh. Can you give me yellow meat watermelon, sir? Yellow meat watermelon. Yeah. Yellow meat watermelon. But I can only do one person. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> Keep sampling, sampling, and all. Yeah, I understand. Yeah. Wow, that's huge. Yeah. You share with them. Thank you. That's how I got you. Thank you. Listen, y'all. Oh, we like this watermelon. I feel like we never really beat the snakes from here, but I want to look at all the snakes. Oh, them, uh, what's it called? They have at this stand these like aged kebabs. I don't know if they aged or the way they marinate them. But they are so tender, and I don't see them out here right now. But I'm gonna see if they maybe have some in the back. And I don't know if three dollars is a good deal or not, but we usually get like you see how they have the ten for twenty eight bucks, and they last us quite some time. We'll freeze them and then come back and eat them. Maple breakfast sausage. And then what are these beef shakes? All type of stuff. Hot dogs. Five pound is 28 bucks. But these are Chicago dogs, all beef. And then these are old fashioned. Oh, look at that bone marrow back here. I don't know. These steaks look a little better, don't they? They look real fresh. Oof. $21.99 a pound. Buffalo with pineapple. I don't know, those are really good. The chicken marinated kebabs. We've made it to the pastries and all the stuff that we really don't need. I don't know, for some reason it's like we, we've gotten our meat from here. Somebody's having a birthday. <laughs> but we've gotten our meat from here before, but I'm not really seeing what I want. And I would hate to leave and just go to the grocery store, but we may have to. Cause I'm with the prices, I don't know. We may have to just go to the grocery store and get the get the steaks. But we are gonna get our vegetables. They got Asian. They got Jamaican. Thai chili. But I can't tell if that's like that. Don't look like steak. It almost looks like like ground up beef, don't it? Oh, those meatballs look kind of good, don't they? Bacon bombs. Uh, the stuffed pork chop. With the uh, sausage in it. Italian Romano chopped pork chops. $9.99 a pound. And then we And then one of those um, apple provolone stuffed pork chops. <laughs> he allowed it because he said it's the beard. So I told him I cut his face out. He's like, why? <laughs> oh, wow. If I knew how to cook a duck, $5.99 a pound. Yeah. The whole duck. Oh, my goodness. This is the fun stuff. It's a, a wine cozy or a is it a wine cozy? But it's shaped like a like a vest. There it is. How cute are all of these little guys? And the macaron selection is crazy. I didn't think 
I like macaroons until we tried them in Vegas and I actually really like them. But they, to me, I don't understand why they're so overpriced. They moved our favorite fish spot, but it's actually farther back now. It's back here. All right, we got a little bit of salmon. We got some kebabs. We're about to get our fruits and vegetables. And then we are about to Oh, unfortunately head to the grocery store to get the steaks because I really didn't see anything that looked too appealing. My favorite person got us all ready to go. <laughs> My pleasure. <laughs> Just wanna do the grapes. Let's do some grapes. How much? I don't, what about this size? Oh, that's the same size? Okay, so the box comes with three and a half pounds. You don't have to get the whole box if you don't want to. Oh. Alright, we got what we needed. We are out of here. Headed to probably Walmart. But yeah, or actually we can go across the street today. So, and then we can go home and start cooking. We literally almost gotta fight your way out of here. Like he got all the stuff in his hands. Cause he got a bunch of like corn and then like stuff that's just a lot to carry so we like to get our vegetables on the way out but they'll see you like with no hands unable to carry anything else and they're still like hey hey over here but i know that's kind of you know that's how they do their marketing so i understand we hope you all really enjoyed exploring the market with us love you guys we will see you in the next one